Josh is because he just plays so carefree. We've seen him attack the strike zone early, try to get out and jump on the first pitch, but he just plays with a love of the game and always having fun. And I think that's allowed him to not have those types of nerves as the games have gone deeper when he hasn't gotten a hit. This will be one way to continue it here because you're going to need to create some offense. Munoz faced this pitcher, Roel Ramirez, on Tuesday in the ninth inning, and he singled against him. Here we go. Line drive, right field, hanging up, Reddick can't get it. 35 in a row. Jairo Munoz, the longest hitting streak in Red Sox organizational history. Save that baseball, that's one for the, the mantle. Jairo Munoz, Dom DiMaggio. In that order, amazing stretch for that, that young man right there. Think about that. Again, maybe down to a final at bat as he was in game number 34 last night. And he delivered on the first pitch yet again. But he's 0 for 2 in this game with a walk, and so there's a lot on this plate appearance right here. There really is. He uh, In the fifth inning, he had a four-pitch walk, but ball four was a good pitch maybe to hit. We're rooting for him, though. I mean, this is so hard to do. Sanabia came in last inning and did give up a leadoff single, but then got the next three batters. He's trying for a two-inning save. So here's Munoz. On the ground, it is off the glove of Caliste. He's going to do it. Hello, Dominic DiMaggio. 34 straight for Jairo Munoz. I think he wants the baseball. Yeah. It was 1949. That Tom DiMaggio, then a member of the Boston Red Sox, hit in 34 straight. And as far as the records go, that was the longest for any Red Sox major or minor leaguer that Gyro has just matched. And look at him running, too. And reacting. And now the tying run comes into the batter's box. Delano DeShields on a bunt. 